Right. All right, so this is some, some anchor uh, fix bought from uh, Interline, okay? Uh, and what it is, it's a chemical anchor. So if you've got a, a fixing point, uh, it's like stonework or some ground that's uh, hollow underneath, um, this is the chemical fixing to use, okay? So I'll explain how it works. So you've got two parts to this that are separately uh, placed in a bag within the nozzle, within this tube, okay? Um, sometimes different types, you get two tubes that mix into one, but this one allows you to use it in a standard skeleton gun, okay? So two bags within this, you cut the bag on the top, okay? Take the um, little cap off there that you can use it again and again if you put the cap on. Okay, with the with the nozzle itself, as the um, as the sort of resin comes out, it mixes together. The chemical mixes together through the tube. Okay, and then it comes out the top. You stick that in the hole that you've drilled. Okay, so what we've got is some threaded bar. So we've got some eight mil threaded bar with a, a nut and a washer on it. Okay, you drill an eight mil hole into the ground, and then you stick the nozzle right in the ground. Squeeze it out. Um, use plenty of stuff in there. And then what we do is, as you'll see in a minute, we'll twist this into the ground um, to, to sort of let it go, obviously, or the resin to get inside all the um, nooks and crannies of the bolt, okay, and the thread there. Okay, so if you want to pop down here, look. Okay, so what we've got is a situation where we've had a, uh, got a, a poor uh, sort of uh, level of fixing underneath. We've got um, some chippings down, but on top of that, um, well, beneath that, we've got some uh, some tarmac, and the tarmac is old, uh, and there's not much to it. So beneath that is some just hardcore and stuff. So what we've got to do is drill the the hole down to a nice eight mil hole, which we've already drilled. Make sure we've got a nice um, get all the debris out, so it's not fouling the bolt as it goes in. And then what we're going to do is, like I said before. Um, you squeeze the nozzle right into the hole and stick that right in there. Um, one thing to note as well, when you first start to use it, you will get a bit of excess. So because you've got to allow it to, uh, the uh, resin to mix, you mix it on the, um, so you squeeze it until it changes the same colour. So it allows the resin to, to um, uh, change colour so it's the same colour. And then when it's the same colour, you know it's mixing. Hi James. Hello bud, how you doing? Alright? Alright man, yeah. It's a nice day to do this, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. Alright? Everybody's very impressed with these, mate, I tell you. Good. That's what we like to eat. Okay. There's plenty of uh, resin in the hole now. Okay. And then as we Twist the bolt in, and make sure we twist it in the fashion. That will allow, I have to just tap it down as well. And that's pretty much it. Plenty of resin in there. Um, as you can see, the fixing isn't amazing as it goes in, but at least it'll act, act as a bit of an anchor. Um, to keep uh, the benches in place. Many thanks. Amazing as it goes in, but at least it'll act, act as a bit of an anchor um, to keep uh, the benches in place. Many thanks.